Hi guys, in this video I will teach you how you can copy a certain folders in Google Drive to another location given that this folder contains Google files so GDocs, G Sheets and other Google files now if you try to do this uh, within Google Drive in your Chrome browser so we have this one folder, original folder with Google files so there's one image and one sample GDoc now if we try to right click and uh, copy there's no option to do that we can only move it to a certain location this doesn't copy it so how do we do this well you might be thinking Google file stream so let's try it out here we have Google file stream installed uh, I have a shortcut folder here which I highly recommend to everybody you can easily access certain folders in Google Drive so this is uh, the folder you're looking at right here in Chrome original folder with Google files and you can see there's these two files here just like you can see here so let's try copy this folder into the copy location so you would come here and you would go copy then you would come to the location where you want to copy the file and click paste and you're gonna get a warning here the operation can't be completed because it isn't supported can't create Google files can't duplicate sample gdoc.gdoc you can't create Google files in Drive file stream yet so uh, this is a limitation as of May 2018 now there's got to be a workaround so let's dig in so how can we achieve this because it's a very important function there are many folders in Google Drive which contain Google files that need to be copied to another location like onboarding packages for example so now the solution is Google Backup and Sync now we don't want to be having these two apps running together if you don't have Google Backup and Sync download it it's free from Google so we're gonna disable uh, Google file stream I'm just gonna pause it and we're gonna sync Google Backup and Sync. So if you want to learn the difference between the two apps, you can check out another video that we did on how to speed up your computer using a Google File Stream and Google Backup and Sync. So simply go here, click on the three dots, and go to Preferences. Click on Google Drive, so you can sync files on Google Drive. And you want to select sync only these folders unless you want to sync the whole thing. And you can see uh, the folder here, Test with the two files and just click OK and that will sync that folder with the files to your computer so now if we go to um, the folder here on Google Drive through Google Backup and Sync so once it's synced you're gonna see the folders and the files here like so uh, now let's try and copy this folder to this location and before we do this uh, I just want to remind you and show you what happened when we try to copy this folder uh, with Google File Stream uh, as you can see here in Google Drive, if we go to the copy location, the folder was copied, uh, but only the image was copied. The GDoc was not. And this is the problem of copying with Google File Stream. So let's delete this um, because we're in the copy location. So we'll remove that. Now, if we go back here to Google Backup and Sync, uh, you'll see this folder here that was copied earlier uh, with only the PNG image. So let's just go ahead and delete that because it'll take some time to sync it uh, with Google um, Backup and Sync. So just delete that. Now let's try to copy this folder. And again, this folder contains the image and the GDoc. I will try to paste it here. Okay. Now you can see it's going to take some time to sync. But once synced, you can check in Google Drive and you'll see both files are in fact copied to the new location. And to double check if the folder was properly copied, you can come here to Google Drive, click on the copy location, click on this folder, and now you can see both files are here. The one downside with this method of using Google Backup and Sync is the fact that you need those folders synced on Google Backup and Sync. So some people will not want this. Uh, there's an alternative on how to copy and paste folders, so I will show you right now. Uh, basically what you could do is you could take the original folder that you want to copy to another location, that's within your Google Drive and that has a, a GDoc or another Google file and uh, just uh, click download okay and then we, then you can go to the copy location we're gonna go ahead and delete this for now and then say you want to paste it here you would right click go upload folders and you would locate that folder but before you do you're gonna have to unzip it just go to your desktop or your saved location double click it will unzip it and then you can have the folder like this and then click upload and click upload again 
and uh, there you have it. The problem with this method is that you're going to notice here there's a dot doc x extension and this happened because when you downloaded that file to your computer it converted to a doc x as you can see here so when you upload to google it's going to keep that extension dot x even though it can convert the file to a gdoc so if you double click it it's already converted to a gdoc and uh, the reason why this is happening in case that yours is an actual document microsoft document is there's a setting here uh, where you're going to have to check this box convert uploaded files to google docs editor format so automatically it's converting that document uh, to a, a gdoc so those are the two main alternatives that allow you to copy and paste folders within google drive which contain google files hopefully this video was helpful and if you liked it please click the like button below thank you very much and have a great day